So this shirt, I just put it on and I thought, what does this feel like wearing? It feels like wearing a cloud. Maybe I lied and this is what I'm going to wear after I'm done filming. It's absolutely not a secret that I have a problem. Okay. <laughs> everyone, welcome back to Alleyways, or if it's your first time here, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch this video. And if you haven't already, please, please, please make sure to join the Alleyways family. Subscribe to my channel, give this video a big thumbs up, and turn on post notifications, not only so you know when I have new content, but also so I can include you in my subscriber shout out. I'm going to be shouting out a very special subscriber at the end of today's video, so make sure you stay tuned until the end in case that's you. Okay. We are back today on the channel with another Pink Lily Boutique haul. I got some really cool new pieces that I'm so excited to share with you. As always, links to these items as well as my personal measurements and the size I ordered these items in will be in the description box down below. If you use those, it helps me tremendously. It allows me to keep bringing you videos like these. Thank you for doing that. All right, let's not talk anymore. Let's go ahead and jump right in. Okay, so I wanted to start off by showing you all these new boyfriend friend or mom, whatever you like to call them, jeans I just got from Pink Lily. I wanted some jeans um, that were in this similar wash but that didn't have any distressing above the knee. That's a request I get a lot for work and so I thought that in getting these that would really help me a lot. I also just think they're really cute. I have them folded up right now to be a little bit higher crop. I love that, especially if you're wearing ankle boots. But if you folded them down, they would hit right at the ankle. They have this awesome row of buttons here that are all functional. I hope this gives you a better idea of the wash too. Some great pockets. This is what they look like in the back. And they're so soft and stretchy, which I love. I, for a long time, didn't wear denim because I felt like I couldn't find any that was soft and comfortable enough. I love Pink Lily's denim. They are all so comfortable and dreamy. So just a great, pair of jeans. I'm so excited to have my wardrobe. I'm going to adjust the camera and then we'll talk about this bodysuit. As promised, here is this bodysuit. So I have lately been ordering a lot of bodysuits from Pink Lily and that is because during the ambassador meetup, I got my first black turtleneck bodysuit from there and the material that they make them out of is so comfortable. It is this really stretchy, soft, dreamy material. And ever since I got that first one, I've gotten so many and this one is one of my favorites. I love that it has these billowy kind of dramatic sleeves. I love the deep neckline and something, I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to tell, it's double lined. So I can pull up the top layer and there's a bottom layer underneath, which is so important for the white items in our wardrobe so we don't have any kind of sheerness. I just think that really speaks to the quality. Um, it does snap in the bottom, but it's super comfortable. I also think it would look really nice kind of pulled off the shoulder like this, just, so comfortable, such a great basic, and a really good layering piece. Let me throw on a couple other pieces now to show you how having two great basics like this in your wardrobe are so essential for just throwing other things on with and styling them a million different ways to get the most out of your pieces. Voila! A whole new outfit, just building on a white bodysuit and a great pair of jeans. I've thrown on this hat that I feature in every haul. I love this felt hat from Pink Lily Boutique. I have it in every color they offer it in. But I also now have layered this shacket. Excuse me, I got the collar kind of messy. So this plaid shacket, I love the color palette. Let's talk about it. It's got great camel, orange, cream, and black, which is great. You could choose any of these colors to layer with. I chose to kind of pull in the cream. Um, I just love how just throwing on a simple hat and jacket makes such a great outfit. I love the feel of this. This is a really popular look, in, especially in Nashville where I'm from. But jackets, I can't get enough of. This one is really nice, warm and wooly on the outside, but more just like a regular button down on the inside. I hope you guys are able to see the difference in the fabric. It has these really nice tortoise buttons. It's just so warm and cozy and really cute. I think this is an adorable outfit and really practical. The weather is changing every single week here. We go from 70 to 30, sometimes in a day, and you've gotta have pieces like this at the ready to keep you warm in the morning and the evening, but to peel off and have a great look underneath for the great temperatures in the middle of the day. 
love this. So let's say the last bodysuit was a little too plain for your taste. Try this one. I saw this on the website and it was the very first thing I added to my cart for this haul. It is this cream. So the last one's a pure white. This one is a creamy ivory bodysuit. The the um, bust portion itself has micro ribbing and then the sleeves have this amazing detailed lace and a little kind of frilly sleeve. I love this. This is such a standout piece to me. I just thought it was so cute and different from anything I'd seen. There is a snap here on the neckline, so you don't have to worry about anything slipping or sliding. It also snaps in the bottom as well. I'll turn around so you all can see the back. Again, this one is totally opaque. You don't have to worry about any sheerness, except on our awesome dramatic sleeves. Just something fun and different. I threw it on with just jeans for a casual everyday look. This would be great paired with a skirt for a fun holiday party look. I think it's so dramatic, different, and um, I'm just really excited to try styling it. How would you wear it? Let me know in the comments down below. So this shirt, I just put it on and I thought, what does this feel like wearing? It feels like wearing a cloud. I'm gonna come up close so y'all can see. It is a waffle knit, kind of relaxed neck sweatshirt. It's it's thin, so it's not quite a tee, but it's thicker than just a tee. It's a really great transitional piece, and look at this dreamy, fuzzy, baby soft material. I love this. I love the relaxed feel. I love how comfortable it is to wear. I love the dramatic kind of loose billowy sleeve. You could definitely tie this up for a cropped look. You could tuck it in and blouse it out. You could just leave it be. It looks great with jeans, would look good with leggings. It just feels good to wear and I think it's so cute. And I've actually never even seen this fabric before. I'm gonna untuck it and turn around so y'all can see the bum coverage that it has. You can see plenty of bum coverage. It's not totally cropped. Um, just a really awesome t-shirty, sweatery thermal. Very cool, love it. Um, probably after I'm done filming, I'm gonna crawl into it. So that's how much I like it. Maybe I lied and this is what I'm going to wear after I'm done filming. I love wearing black. It's my favorite color to wear. And I saw this online and it screamed Allie Sutton, Allie Sutton screamed my name at me. I was like, it, I've never seen anything more me. So it's kind of like a really relaxed, t-shirty, stretchy, soft corduroy material. It also has this cool front pocket and I love the detail. So the corduroy pattern goes um, vertically and then horizontally. And then it has these really cool kind of bat wingy sleeves. Love, I kind of pulled it up so they look a little more blouse, but they can be full length as well and it has a hood. I got this because I thought it would be the perfect, I've been traveling like crazy lately, and I thought this would be perfect to throw on over leggings and a sports bra to go through the airport in. It's comfy, it's chic, it's a little bit elevated. I'll show you, I'll pull it down too, as you can see. Plenty of bum coverage, nice length. This fabric is just really comfortable. I hope you can see all the give and stretch it has, and it's plenty warm on too. I think this would be such a great airport look. Stay tuned because if I, when I travel next, I will wear this and post it. Um, also, it's December and I am pale, and you know that means I got another luxury tan. This time I got it in the shade dark. I feel like the last couple times I've used the medium, it hasn't been quite as dark as I wanted, so I'm gonna try the dark and I'll report back. I love the pink lily tan because it's so easy and it doesn't streak, um, and I've almost used all of my medium, so got this. Also, if you're looking for a really good gift or stocking stuffer, I think this would be awesome. So just throwing that out there, got another luxury tan. Now let's talk about shoes. All right, the first pair of shoes I got were these black strappy platformy heels. I'm gonna step aside so y'all can see so it's not like eaten up on my shirt. They are a suede material. I love the thin strap on the ankle, but then um, the strap over the foot being a little bit thicker. 
this height for me is perfect just the tiniest platform just cute and simple and stylish like this is my favorite kind of shoe I love that the heel itself is a little bigger it's not a stiletto so they're gonna be a lot easier to walk in this is just a really good basic that I needed in my wardrobe because I've worn my last ones out and they just got these and so they I'm so so excited they're absolutely perfect um, and I know I'm gonna wear the heck out of them so great new pair of black heels for my wardrobe gonna be a staple while we're on wardrobe staples if you don't have a great pair of black over-the-knee boots where have you been uh, if you don't I found some for us I love these okay so these are a really awesome pair of pointed toe high heeled nice chunky heel again great for walking stretchy suede black over the knee boots look at this stretch it's gonna that means it's gonna be really nice and tight it's gonna fit on your leg like a sock and then it does have a zipper on the inside which means it's gonna be really easy to get into I like that these are kind of suede on the front and then a stretchy material on the back personally suede can just be really difficult to take care of and I feel like if everything is not all suede that's gonna be a little bit nicer I just love these I didn't have any pointed toe boots and my other black over the knee boots I've been wearing they're all of my Instagram seriously I've been wearing them for like the last three years they're just getting some wear and tear I needed a new pair I loved these I'm gonna wear them all the time it's just a perfect pair of shoes really great quality so excited Yay, hoorah. Okay, so this is the last item I have for now. Next item will probably be on a different day. So it might look a little different next time you see me. Um, I do have more things coming, but last item for now, I have needed some new really great dresses for work. I've had a lot of people request them for different spokesperson jobs I've been doing. Uh, and I saw this one and I just thought the color would look really nice on camera. And now that I'm seeing it in the monitor, we can confirm that that's true. I love it. It's just a really nice, universally flattering blue. There's micro ribbon. It's kind of a sweater dress, but it's more of like just a thicker t-shirty material. I love this little belt in the middle, but one thing that kind of bugs me is these belt loops. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I don't know if I need to like tuck them back or just tie this over it. You can't kind of notice there. That's just one kind of funky thing. I like that it hits just above the knees. I think this is a great piece for work. They do have it in other colors. Um, this is what it looks like from behind. But I think it looks really nice on camera. Like I said, I just needed a great new dress for work um, that was easy. I could just throw it on with a new pair of heels and be done. This is that. I'm so thrilled. Okay. <laughs> just like that, we are back. I just got some new things from Pink Bully that I am in love with, starting with this pink turtleneck, almost mock neck sweater. I love the vibrant color. I love the soft, fuzzy fabric. Um, even though it looks like it has wool, it doesn't actually. I love the detail around the neck and the sleeves and that it's slightly cropped. Don't mind my sweatpants. I'm just having a cozy day at home. Um, but you can see it hits right at my hip bone, so it's not too long, which makes it pair really nice with jeans. It's just such a beautiful color. It's so warm, so cozy, and so soft. I absolutely love this sweater and I'm gonna be honest with you guys I got this about a week ago and I've already worn this like four times I wore it to a party I wore it to tape other videos I wore it to take some photos it's just a really really great piece I also got this really light Cinderella-ish blue turtleneck mock neck <laughs> again another mock neck turtleneck you can see it's like really wide and loose this one is a little bit more cropped it has a band along the bottom and hits right at my belly button but I loved this kind of waffle knit pattern I loved the soft color I loved the style everything about it I just absolutely adore um, and it's really it's more like a chenille so it's even softer I would say than our last one and it's not really a blend um, I love this one let me know which sweater is your favorite I have another one next <laughs> I went a little crazy with the turtlenecks. Okay, next up we have this one. This one is the most cropped and fitted, and I love that. It's fitted right around the waist, so it kind of cinches in and then puffs out. The neck is more fitted, but it still is that mock length that I love. And then look at the sleeve. It's fitted all the way to the middle of your forearm and then blouses out, but the sleeve is a little longer. You can see it goes over my hand. This. I love. I've worn this a bunch too. I wore this in my boiled custard video if you watched that. 
oh, I just think this is so cute and all of these make me feel like um, I'm going seeing in a super glam 1980s movie. That's the vibe. Very specific vibe, but that is the vibe. Which one do you like best? So obviously, if we're going for a 1980s ski vibe, glam ski vibe, we're going to need a great jacket. So I got this charcoal um, puffer jacket. It feels like sweatshirt material on the outside. It's so, so soft and kind of stretchy. I hope y'all can see that it has some give. Um, it's a really beautiful bluish gray color. Again, it has this fitted sleeve to the middle of the forearm, which is nice. It keeps in a lot of warmth. And then it also has that along the bottom. It has two really cozy puffy pockets. It's a little bit shorter, which I really like. Um, it's so comfortable. And then I wanted to show y'all how cool are these buttons. So they're an antique gold snap. Oh, that's so satisfying. I love this jacket. They have it in other colors. It's really warm, cute, trendy. It's part of the ski edit. Again, our 1980s vintage glam ski vibe is so strong right now. It's absolutely not a secret that I have a problem. I am obsessed and addicted to pink lily sweatshirts. I have so many now. <laughs> I'm literally running out of room in my closet, but I cannot stop. And that is especially because they just have been creating these kind of like vintage corded sweatshirts. Each one of these is a custom wash. So they all are like unique. It's a little bit different. I saw this one with the little pink smiley face and the color is kind of like a dusty bluish gray. And I have this style and um, a Christmas one. I have a Christmas one like this and one that says Tennessee. And when I saw they had it with a uh, smiley face, it's like, I need it because now I can't wear my Christmas one. And then the Tennessee one I wear all the time. So I needed to have another one in the lineup. So I got this smiley face sweatshirt. You can see it's long. So technically I could pull this down and wear it with over the knee boots as a dress or with biker shorts. I think that would be such a cute look. The inside is not the corded material. The inside is slick. It is a lighter sweatshirt, but the vintage feel is just so good. I love this so much. Like I said, it's a problem, but it's not gonna stop. If you have a pink lily sweatshirt, you know what I mean. I know our friend Ludi on the channel is like me and like cannot stop getting them. I just can't, I'm not going to. Yeah, I'm not going to stop. I got another sweatshirt. Okay, this one I thought was so cute. It says coffee, please. It's a really cool, like brownish purple color that I feel like I saw a lot growing up. This color is super popular in the 90s, especially with sweat sets, and then it kind of disappeared and now it's back. This is the standard pink lily sweatshirt. So it's lined with this really kind of soft, fuzzy material. It's a little, it's like thin and light, but still really warm. Um, I just thought this was so cute. Loved the color, loved that it said coffee, please. You guys know I also have a problem with coffee. Um, I want it all the time. And I just thought that this was so cute and comfortable and so I had to have it. So here we are. <laughs> I mean, <sighs> yep. And next time I'll probably get another one. Another problem you guys probably know I have is two piece sets. I talk about it all the time on the channel. I'm a sucker for sets. And when I saw this one, I fell in love. It's this really cool tan color. It has micro ribbing and it's a little cropped sweatshirt. You can see there's a band here and then around the wrists. I just, it's like light, it's comfy, it's cozy. And then the shorts are the same fabric with a functional drawstring. And I love that the strings are canvas, but then there's metal aglets. Um, so you can cinch this in. It's just a cute set and I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I've worn it the last two days. I wore this on Christmas Day um, And it was so cute and cozy. It feels like wearing pajamas, but it looks like you're actually putting effort in and It's been really warm in Nashville, but then it's cold in the mornings and the night So it's nice to have shorts and a long sleeve set. I feel like it's a good combo It also has two pockets in the front and a bonus pocket on the booty Three pockets in one matching piece set. Like what? What could be better? This is, I'm, I'm living my dream right now. I love this. I look at a little two pack of scrunchies. How cute are these? So they are tan velvet and black velvet with pearl appliques. How cute is this? Such a great little gift. 
and that is it for today's video oh my goodness thank you so much for taking the time to watch it truly means the world to me if you have any questions um, just comment below I'll do my level best to get back with any answers that I can help with as always a special thank you to my live chat crew who's here with me now live chat crew I love you so so much if you're somebody who's looking for kindness community and friendship please join us as we are chatting on my premieres Wednesdays and Sundays at 8 p.m. Central I also want to give a big shout out to Emily Schlichting I hope I pronounced your name correctly you left a really kind comment and requested a shout out on one of my Disney vlogs and I wanted to welcome you to the family and say thank you so so much for your support it means the world to me I love you I love you all and I can't wait to see you next time right here on alleyways bye